All right, as I said before, you know, I'm going to make a slice on the stone. Trying to get this part out. See right here the inclusion? So I'm going to make a cut. The inclusion goes all the way through here. You can see the line right there. It goes over here as well. So here's the cut that I'm going to make. right here as you can see there you go so here we have the table of the stone pretty much I'm gonna put the table here and I'm gonna preform this side now this is the other side of the stone we can still cut a smaller stone out of this one as you can see right here this is the color and then I'm gonna preform. I'm gonna perform this one and concentrate on this one. And then if you guys decide, we can always make an elongated emerald cut out of this one, or we can trim it over here and make a squarish. But I think we take a better advantage if we make an emerald cut elongated, you know. But here, uh, on this one, as I'm gonna start preforming, uh, it tends to be probably uh, an emerald cut. I think it's a, an ideal shape right here, taking advantage of the natural formation and putting the pavilion on this side because as you can see, the color is only on the surface, on the bottom. So we take advantage of these angles for the pavilion and uh, preforming an emerald cut out of this one. It's gonna be squarish emerald cut.